Hey guys, Mrs. Swinter here. I've never done this before, so we're going to try Grading Tangy Tuesday. I have the answers on your screen, but I will also read them, so if you want to be looking at your paper. So here we go. One down is seven, S-E-V-E-N. Four down is hundredth, H-U-N-D-R-E-D-T-H. Five down is thousand, T H O U S A N D. Six down is sixteen, S I X T E E N. And eight down is sixty, S I X T Y. Two across is nine, N I N E. Three across is eight, E-I-G-H-T. Seven across is less, L-E-S-S. -S. Nine across is four, F-O-U-R. And 10 across is 21, T-W-E-N-T-Y dash O-N-E. So if you got all those correct, give yourself a plus one at the top. On snake, Mrs. Twinter usually just grades the very last number. So if you'll follow your puzzle all the way around and look at your last number, it should say 12 plus 8 equals 20. And on the bottom puzzle, the very last one is 16 minus 8 is 8. So if you had those two numbers correct, give yourself a plus 1 at the top. You can also look at the puzzle on your screen to see if you want to check some of your other answers. All right, Numtanga. Mrs. Twinter is going to read just going straight across. So row one is five sixth, one fifth. Row two, one sixth, three eighths, one third. Row three, one fourth, one half. Row four is five eighths, four fifths, and one eighth. And the very last row is three fourths and seven eighths. And Kakuma, Mrs. Twinter just grades the final answer. If you want to check your puzzle to see, um, you can look there at final puzzle. But your final answer should be 23. Equato. I'm going to read the um, blank answer starting on the left side and going to the right. Row 1 should be 1 and 2. Row 2 just has an empty box of 6. Row 3 is 7 and 3. Row 4 is 8 and 9. And the bottom row is 4 and 5. If you could, on the front of your paper, put out of 5 how many you got correct. Maybe make a note of your favorite puzzle this week and the hardest puzzle this week. And in just a second, your next assignment is going to be to submit your score. So. Go ahead and close out this video and look for the next activity to do in your math folder. Thanks so much.